Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in ScreenFlow 10. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create custom keyboard shortcuts. To view all of the default keyboard shortcuts available in ScreenFlow 10, go up to the top menu, go to ScreenFlow Preferences, or use the keyboard shortcut Command, Comma to open up preferences. Go ahead and click on the fourth icon, Shortcuts. If you know what you're looking for, there's a search field here so you can type in the name of a menu item. You can also type in characters. So if you wanna see all the keyboard shortcuts that use the semicolon, just type in the semicolon, and that will pull everything up available in this list. In order to create your own custom keyboard shortcuts, or to modify or edit any of the default keyboard shortcuts, you must first create your own custom keyboard shortcut set. First, you can just click on the drop down and choose configure. Click on the plus icon. I'll just choose duplicate default. Give it a name. Click OK. And now in this list, I can choose from the default, which I can't modify, or I can go into Mike's keyboard shortcuts. And now I can edit or create my own custom keyboard shortcuts. You can also create your own custom keyboard shortcut set if you try to make any changes to the default set. I'll go to pause recording. When I click in here, as soon as I try to enter my own custom keyboard shortcut, I get this warning telling me that I cannot update the default set. So if I wanna make any changes, I must make a copy or make a new set. So I'll click this. Now you see here, I'm working on the duplicate of a default. And when I go to pause recording, I can just click and now I can enter in my own custom keyboard shortcut. To rename or delete a custom keyboard shortcut set, just click on the drop down and go to configure. Just click, you can just select it and type in a new name. And if you wanna delete a custom set, just select it and click on the minus key. If you want to make a backup of your keyboard shortcuts that you could share with somebody else or import into another copy of ScreenFlow, just select the keyboard shortcut set, go back to the configure menu and choose export, give it a name, choose where you wanna save it, then just click save. Then if you wanna import it, you just go to import, locate the file, and then you can import it back into ScreenFlow. And to view and edit any of the custom keyboard shortcuts that you've created, go up to the preferences menu, click on shortcuts, Select your custom keyboard shortcut set. Next to show, you will see all. That will be all available keyboard shortcuts. Then you will see customize. Click on that to view all of your custom keyboard shortcuts that you've created. If you want to remove one, just select it and just click on the X and click off. And if you want to make any changes, you can just click and just enter in a new keyboard shortcut. And if you ever see this little exclamation, that means that there's already one created for that. So just try something else and you're good to go. And that is Keyboard Shortcuts and ScreenFlow 10. My name is Mike Murphy, cheers.